Chris with HobbyKing.com and we've got some new multi-star elites to add to the lineup. Now, if you're not familiar with the multi-star elite, the multi-star elite is the top tier best multi-rotor motor that you can absolutely buy. Now, these motors are always geared towards a specific application and these are no exception. Now, multi-star elites, when I say top tier, are made with 0.2 laminations, N45 magnets, 180 degree oxygen free wire, EZO Japan bearings, and a host of other uh, features such as balancing on these uh, and QC. These are the best motors that you can absolutely buy. And don't take my word for it, check the reviews on the net uh, for the Multistar Elites. First motor that we've got here is the 4114, the beast motor right here. Now this is designed with an integrated uh, prop adapter right onto the top of it, which is for the folding style 15.5 uh, uh, props. Uh, designed for your 800 millimeter to 1200 millimeter octos and quads and hexes in that size range. Uh, heavy lift applications. Uh, now the KV is uh, 330, so it's designed right around a 6S uh, setup with these folding style uh, blades. Now there's a lot of different blades that you can use and this is adaptable to all of those, uh, whether they be carbon fiber, different uh, profiles, a couple different pitches. They're all right around that 15.5 uh, uh, inch length. So it works with DJI, Genfans, uh, uh, Tomos, uh, uh, Zetas. Um, any of those uh, blades are just uh, bolts right in there and allows for quick uh, transportation of these larger multi-rotors by allowing these blades to, uh, to just fold back. Now let's take a look at the build quality of this particular motor. It has an integrated cooling uh, fan right into the top. Definitely with these, uh, these higher lift uh, capacity motors, you know, heat uh, is definitely an issue. So it's able to, to take care of the cooling right here with the integrated uh, cooling fan all into this top part, which is uh, integrated to the prop adapter. If I roll this over, this is where the magic is. Let's take a look at the build quality. Huge EZO magnet, uh, EZO bearings on the bottom, uh, preloaded uh, bearings on, on it uh, with, the, with the integrated five millimeter shaft. Uh, the, uh, the pulls on this, 22, 24. Uh, so it's got a lot of torque at the lower end and a lot more efficiency in the lower end, right where these motors are needed for that heavy lift application. The machine quality, the wind quality on this motor is absolutely unmatched. Mounting 25 millimeter cross and 30, 30.1 uh, on your tri mounting right in there. Absolutely adaptable to most frames in that 800 to 1200 millimeter range. And as far as power, definitely an upgrade as far as quality, workmanship uh, and efficiency for this particular motor in that size range. Next, this is a very, very unique motor and it's absolutely geared uh, and designed to replace your 450, the 330 class motors. Now the most popular motor in that size range is your 2212s. Uh, everyone and their brother sells them. The, the Emax uh, PM series, um, Multistars, uh, just, there, there are just so many 2212s on the market, it's unbelievable. This motor is the absolute best motor that you can get for a direct uh, replacement as well as just a new build in that size range. And I'm going to show you why. First thing, uh, I'm going to pick up and, and, uh, and just uh, roll through this and we're going to compare it to a standardized 2212. If I hold it up, you're going to notice the, the anodizing stops right here and we've got uh, metallic color right in here. And that's actually because this is a steel shaft all the way through, a hardened steel shaft that goes right through here all the way down through to the bottom. So it has a steel shaft that goes all the way through and your prop adapter, instead of being threaded onto an aluminum machined upper uh, uh, housing is actually uh, a solid shaft that goes straight through the motor. So you've got no problems with these shearing off in a crash, uh, problems with them getting damaged in a, in a crash, uh, as, as well with the, uh, the, the larger props, 10s and the 9.5s available in the quick releases uh, with shear issues. You've now got a steel shaft that runs through this, unlike the 2212s. Another thing right here on the bottom is take a look at the diameter of the shaft. Since it goes all the way through, it's a four millimeter shaft instead of a three millimeter shaft. And because of that, look at the size of this bearing. It's almost double that of a standard 2212. Here, I've got a 2212 here, and we'll just take a look at what I'm, I'm talking about as far as reference. So at this point, it is the same steel shaft that goes straight through the motor, all the way down through the bottom. And it starts right here and continues up where this is aluminum housing and that three millimeter shaft right here on the bottom, this little three millimeter shaft goes up through here and utilizes a set screw that locks it inside this aluminum housing right in here, where this one's steel and goes all the way through. Let's take a look at these bearings on the bottom. Uh, you can see the size of this bearing versus the size of this bearing. It's almost double the size with this four millimeter shaft. Uh, EZO Japan bearings, so these things are absolutely bulletproof. These larger bearings, less load on them, obviously gonna uh, support the shaft much better. And, and they're just gonna be indestructible and last you a long time. So you're gonna have no balance problems uh, or, or failures in these motors structurally with that steel shaft and these ginormous bearings in them. So obviously you can't even compare these two motors. Now all 2212s are built uh, almost identically. Three millimeter shafts, same size bearings. You might have better bearings, 
but the size is going to be the same where this new style motor is utilizing these larger shafts. Now the main reason for this is that these quick release props that are becoming ever popular for, you know, uh, Phantoms and DJI style uh, uh, applications, uh, just quickly uh, just jump on the motor. Oh, I got the wrong side. These motors come by the way as clockwise, counterclockwise. They just come right on and, and quick thread right on. These are becoming more popular and more sizes are becoming available. This is your standard 943, 95s are available and even 10 inches are now available. So the new 2212 size actually gives you about 20% more power and efficiency over your standard 2212, uh, but it's in the exact same form factor to bolt in any application that uses a standard 2212 and utilizes the exact same style props, uh, quick release props. Now, a couple of the other things that you might note on, on the, uh, the motor itself is it doesn't enclose the, the lower uh, mounting. It's identical as far as like the, uh, the, the bell and the, the, the distance from the mounting on the bottom to the top of the motor, uh, but it just doesn't wrap the aluminum all the way to the bottom. The reason for that, there are some frame applications that, uh, that there is clearance issues right into this. So uh, we decided to uh, just go ahead and eliminate and, uh, and mimic the new standard on these motors, which is opening the lower bell and allow some of these uh, frames uh, to have a tighter housing right in there. Makes no difference on it. I mean, if we were to cut these off, uh, it's the exact same point. It's just and wrapping and enclosing the lower uh, portion of that. But it also exposes these absolutely pristine, beautiful winds on this particular motor. So Multistar Elites, best motors you can get. Pretty clear that the build uh, quality and difference between the 2212 and 2312 and the Multistar Elite line. And the value on these motors are absolutely unbelievable. Comes as a pack of two, so you get a clockwise, counterclockwise in the set. So if you got a hex, just buy three of them. Got a quad, just buy two boxes. This is sold as an individual. Like I was uh, mentioning, these blades are not included on this because there's a, a couple different styles, even carbon fiber ones available. So you're just getting the motor with the integrated uh, prop adapter. No props with this, it's just the two motors as a set. These are up on the new items page. They're absolutely phenomenal. They cannot be beat uh, as far as performance, quality, and the price. Check them out. As always, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We will see you guys next time.